Hi, this is my um, second video blog. Um, the first one went well, people um, commented on it and said they liked it, so I thought I'd do another one. Um, also, it saves me, um, saves me typing um, anymore. Again, like the last one, it's a Sunday after a, a busy week and um, a bit too knackered to be bothered um, typing things up. So um, I thought it's been two months since I did a video blog and it's been a month since I've done um, a blog post. So um, one comment I did get back from the previous video blog was that uh, it was a little bit long. So I'm going to try to be a little bit quicker this time and speak um, about less things and a little bit less detail. So um, I'm going to talk about two different things. Um, one, which is the progress of The Serpent Sword, which is the first book in my series. Um, the progress um, of submissions for that to agents. And the second thing I'm going to talk about is um, the progress of the sequel to The Serpent Sword, which at the moment I'm calling The Cross and The Curse. Um, OK, so first things first, um, I've submitted The Serpent Sword to agents. Um, I'm, I'm going to send out to uh, probably over a dozen, maybe maybe close to 20 agents in total. I've got um, shortlisted. Um, I've made a list of agents who represent um, similar works by similar writers and targeting those. I've sent eight out so far. One um, was to the agent after the open day where I pitched the novel. Um, so that was the agent I sent to then. And I posted to another seven um, agents uh, last week. So I'm still waiting back to, to hear from them. And then in a few weeks time, I'll um, send out to some other agents. The agents I've sent to, although they're all shortlisted, um, the ones I've selected for the first tranche of, um, of submissions have been based purely on the fact that they accept electronic submissions. So it's a little bit easier. So the ones that are sort of still waiting to be sent um, are mainly it's the ones that I need to print out a manuscripts or the first few chapters and send in. So um, I'm going to wait and see what happens with the with the first ones first. Um, so for submissions, for those who don't know, you need to send in um, a, a letter, a cover letter, explaining a little bit about yourself and about the book. And that takes an inordinate amount of time to get it written and to make it as good as you possibly can. Um, so. Uh, yeah, so that you wouldn't believe for a few hundred words how long that could take. Um, then you've got to do a synopsis of the book, which can only be about a page or maybe a couple of pages. And that takes a long time to try and condense 107,000 words, um, in my case, for The Serpent Sword um, into into what is it like seven or 700 words, 600 words in, in a synopsis. So um, those two things, um, and then of course the first three chapters or so of the book, depending on where you're sending it. Some of the people ask for extra things like a resume or a CV specifically for your writing credentials. Um, that's one of the reasons I put one of the people off, one of the one of the agents off because they're asking for a resume, and I haven't got one put together for my writing yet, so I wanted to to wait for a while. Um, so that's it really. I've submitted to, as I say, eight agents. I'm waiting. I've got a spreadsheet. I'll, I'll track um, any responses I get. I'm, you know, fingers crossed, but I wouldn't be at all surprised um, if I get um, lots of rejections or at least eight rejections. Um, but I'll keep you posted. And of course, if I do get um, anywhere, anyone requests a full manuscript, I will be sure to let you all know and, um, and shout it from the rooftops. Um, but watch this space. So the second thing I was going to talk about is just the um, the, the status of um, the progress of my second um, book. So following on straight away from the um, the Serpent Sword it starts in six thirty four, and um, yeah, twelve thousand words in now into the first draft, and I'd expect it to be somewhere around the same sort of length as the as the Serpent Sword, maybe a little bit longer, um, but we'll see how that goes. So it's probably probably about ten percent of the way in. Um, if I get if I really get carried away, it might be less than that, I, mean, I suppose, in proportion to the to the total. But um, at the moment, looking at the the basic synopsis that I've worked out, um, I reckon probably about ten percent of the way into the story. So yeah, it, it's, it was slow going early on, but um, things are speeding up, um, and um, 
yeah, I look forward to getting it out there to some test readers. Um, something I'll talk about in the future actually is the test readers and all of their the help that I've got from them. Um, I've had some some great feedback from people. Um, as I say, I'll go into more detail in another blog post about that. So, but thanks to to the people that have read the the Serpent Sword in its final draft state and all the comments I got back from earlier drafts as well. So, thanks to everybody um, who did that for me, and um, thanks to everybody for watching. Um, this or reading my my tweets or my blog posts um, and follow me on, on my Facebook page. If you're watching this and you haven't followed my Facebook page um, or or you haven't followed me on Twitter or you're not following the, the blog, then um, please do so. All the details are on the blog page um, and um, at the end of this movie as well, I'll stick in all the details there. So please yeah, follow me on any of your usual social media and uh, look forward to speaking to you again soon. Thanks a lot.